Greetings Twitch, it's an afternoon stream for once, which is uh, strange for me, I don't know how the mic sounds, I accidentally dropped it yesterday, so if that sounds terrible, that's entirely on me. Um, right, um, okay, so we got three badges yesterday, where are we, which city are we in? Good, we're in Cerulean City, that's absolutely fine. So, coming off the back of yesterday's raid, which was awesome, um, put me in a really good mood actually about, you know, going forward with the stream. Um, I need some repels because otherwise I'm going to end up losing my temper in the next part of the game. Hopefully that's enough. Right, so today we are going to go through Rock Tunnel. Um, obviously yesterday we had to catch a cutter, um, so we're going to have to bring the cutter with us throughout the next portion of the game until we get to the um, until we get to the Pokemon Center outside Rock Tunnel. Entirely testing myself now as well to remember the Rock Tunnel layout. Right, so bear with me because I'm going to just add me some things. God Almighty. <laughs> okay, so that doesn't work. That's fine. Alright. Hey up, Christian. Yeah, alright. How was work, my dude? Do you want to see the new team, by the way? The new look team. We've got something called Cut now, because we had to go get a cutter. <laughs> That's the only change that happened yesterday after you'd gone, I think. Um, we had to run around like a bit of a lunatic and find something that could learn cut. Which was nice. Not sure how long I'm gonna have to stream today, but you know. Fingers crossed it'll be alright. Fingers crossed it'll be nice. Oh, a growl lift, that's a good start for them. Sean out there. Oh, and um, by the way, Christian, yesterday I, um, in the midst of the raid, I got myself all excited and distracted, and we accidentally lost Wayne because I threw it out against um, against the cloister. That was it, and the damn thing used Aurora Beam. So we have, unfortunately, <laughs> we have lost Wayne. Um, but it's alright because we're going to get at the very least two more encounters in this episode, so fingers crossed we'll be alright. A wiggly tough. I mean, we're, we're pretty we're pretty much steamrolling through the rest of these Pokemon anyway, but I think the gym battle was the problem. I think that's where we had a problem was, um, was with Surge. I don't remember, I'll have to go back and watch the actual footage and and maybe upload it to YouTube, because I've stopped doing that recently for some unknown reason. Uh, yeah, get Orphan out there. We nearly lost Orphan, actually, at one point to a Clamp attack. Bless him, he ended up on 1 HP. <laughs> I'd have been very upset if we'd lost Orphan. Orphan's, um, Orphan's been brilliant throughout this stream. Could have been. Could have been. He was stuck in a clamp attack and uh, his HP got absolutely demolished. Ah, oh, we don't need Leah, do we? Stop learning Leah, you stupid little turd. Thank you. Good God. But we managed to get some super potions as well, so that's good, because potions were doing fuck all. Um, what's this TM? Anything good? We need good TMs right now. Rest. Oh, to hell with rest. I'm actually saying that, you get the Pokey Flute soon, don't you? So rest might... Cut is a, um... He's a Weeping Bell, maybe? Yeah, he's a Weeping Bell. This thing can really mess up my Jinx Killer. I really wish I... You know what, I might rename it to Jinx Bane now when we get to, um... When we get to Thingy. When we do the Lavender Town stuff. 
and I know a nice quick way through Lavender Town. Looking forward to that. A drowsy. Um, oh, uh, drowsies are tanky as hell, aren't they? See if we can burn it. Oh Christ alive. You know, I was thinking just tail whipping and quick attack, but never mind, it just, uh, it just disabled my quick attack. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, no, you don't. Yeah, Ember's fine. We do need to get some TMs though to really, like I could do with Flamethrower or Fire Blast or something like that to, to stick on the, um, on the Ninetales, just to give it a little bit more a little bit more oomph, as it were. Oh, God, it's freezing in my house right now. I don't even know why. Ha! Let's see how this goes. I bet it's got an ice type move by now. <laughs> we don't want to play play silly buggers with it. Yeah, it's a pro Oh, fuck you. It's a problem. Well, I mean, at least it can't paralyze me, and that shouldn't do too much damage. That said, I'd rather be fucking paralysed right now. Wake up, you stupid fox! Oh, God almighty. Would have been just my luck that it used Lovely Kiss on my wake up turn and got the hit. Oh, we got burned! Sweet! Not that it'll matter because it goes down now. Jinx has got a really messed up eye. I should probably move Jinx Killer from the first position as well, because uh, it's levelling up quite nicely now. Um, Orphan, you're going to be great for this bit. I don't know if you were here at the beginning, but I bought some, um, bought some repels as well, because, you know, going through thingies a pain in the ass enough. Fine! Butthole. I wouldn't mind having a muck actually, that'd be quite cool. I don't know what I'd use it for, but you know, it'd be nice to have muck. What the hell happened there? Ah, that's what the hell happened there. Stream went weird. Stream gone weird. Stream gone weird. There we go, I think it's fixed. I don't know why it keeps doing that. It's making me paranoid for the diamond uh, playthrough that I've got planned for January. Ah, oh, the special diamond playthrough that... Oh, these things are tanks. It's alright, Jinx Killer's got this. Ah, 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 ah. Do not put me to sleep. And a stammy. I reckon Randy, oh, them things are quick though. If it's got any psychic moves on it, I've just made a terrible, terrible judgement. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, I learned yesterday about it's not very effective text is actually a lie because it's, um, because of the way that this game, it's one of the many, many coding areas in this game that neutral damage on a Pokemon that would normally take, you know, not very or super effective damage, uh, reads as that, even though it's neutral. What we got? Oh, we got one of them. I've got one. It's called Sean. Be gone, evil Blastoise. Right, so what we can do, we can re-encounter because that's what we call the species clause. So we can hopefully get something else if something else wants to pop out. Anything else. There we go. Good God almighty. Off of. <laughs> okay, so um, at the minute we are kind of stuck with a Blastoise fight. Try, trying its best to get us involved in a fight with it. But we need anything that's not a Blastoise. Yeah. That's the problem with only 150 Pokemon now, I suppose. It's not got that shallow of a pull. 
Oh, for God's sakes! Oh. Eventually, it's got to be something else. It has got to be something that's not a Blastoise. Oh, a Polyrath! Alright, that's... I mean, it's definitely something else. Uh, not sure what I'm going to do to weaken the damn thing, but... Oh, how we're going to catch it, is it... Mm. Can it learn cut? Because if this thing can learn cut, it's going on the team. Let's have a look. Poly, Wrath, Gen, 1, Learn Set. Knackers. It can't learn cut, so it might... It might be worth keeping in the bob balls. See, the problem with Polyrath is it's another... It's another stone evolution, so that means that the, the set, the move set that it's got now is it's kind of stuck with until I can... You know, until I can get some decent things on it. But that said, its moves aren't bad. Body Slam would be quite nice to have, wouldn't it? I mean, if Blastoise could wake up, I'd be quite happy. Come on, Blastoise, thank you, my word. Oh, that wasn't the crit that I wanted right then. Right, do I think we're going to catch this? Because I somehow doubt it. Come on, apart from the water attack and double slap, they kind of suck. Oh, bugger me. False swipe would be quite nice to have right now, but... I don't think that was a Gen 1 move. Come on. Oh. You know what I could do with right now? Hypnosis, that'd be nice to have. Oh, Lord alive. This isn't going well so far. We haven't even got a sing like a second shake. How much damage is that doing too? So we should probably heal. Just to be safe, you know, make sure that Sean doesn't accidentally get his ass knocked out. Yeah, a body slam crit would have been a nightmare right then. Oh. Oh. And we got it. We got it. Let's call it, um... Let's call it Punch Toad. If it'll fit. I'm not sure if Punch Toad fits, but we're going to give it a go. Punch. I think it fits. Punch Toad. Yes, Punch Toad. There we go, Punch Toad has been transferred. So we might get that out when we get to um, the Pokemon Center. Blastoise is asleep right now, so that's good. That's nice. And annoyingly it resets every time you leave a battle. Is there any, any hidden items? No. Nope. Gen 3's got a shitload of hidden items. Right, let's do this dude now! Uh, also, by the way, I'm not allowed to use cut in battle because obviously it's technically illegal. Um, no, there is a couple. There is a few because you, you do get an item finder later on. I think you've got off caught like... Yeah, yeah, there's like 20... Yeah, no, yeah, cut is technically illegal because um, we caught him in a route we already caught a Pokemon in. I can't remember what he, we caught there, but... It was where we got the match champ, actually. That was what we got there. Alright, Sean should be able to tank a couple of hits before he wakes up. So yeah, because we're using him as a... Um, we're effectively using him as a, just a, a HM slave. He's not actually battle legal. Um, and so so uh, basically what I'm saying is we need to find something else that has cut or can learn cut that's legal before we can, you know, fill out the team. 
Bloody hell, Sean. Took your time, didn't you? That won't even kill now, now, now look. Yep, there we go. Who didn't see that coming? Vulpix looks so happy. I mean, not now. It's not happy now. Now it's now it's unconscious, but, you know. How much money have you got? Give me some of it. That's not... <coughs> oh, good God. I don't know what the hell that was. Dear Christ. Yeah, exactly. Blastoise is, Blastoise is fine. I'm, I'm chuffed to bits that we caught a Blastoise, man. Especially at level 5. So it was easy enough to catch, even with a with a catch rate that it had. A big scary metapod now. Goodbye. What's next? Executor. I ah, will keep out the uh, keep out the the nine tails. It's gonna hypnotize me, so a bird would be nice. Oh, barrage. Oh, okay. They are such good Pokemon in Gen 1 or Exeggutar, they are so OP. That bloody... Ah, there it is! There it is! Do I have an awakening? There we go. Kind of banking on the fact that... Hmm. So I was about to say, I'm kind of banking on the fact that Hypnosis won't hit twice in a row, because it's only got 55% accuracy. But, you know... <laughs> I believe the phrase is, shit happens. You know, you can tag yourself on this as family friendly and it was so tempting to do so. Alright, Vileplume. It's gonna have petal dance this thing, that's gonna hurt. There it is. There it is. Is that gonna do much? Oh god, alive, that does 12 damage, thank god I'm gonna win this fight. Oh, Nine Tails came came through there, didn't it? Brilliant, brilliant. Uh, we'll just use a regular potion now, just to get Nine Tails back over into the green. We're gonna fight you as well, because today we're fighting everybody. Can't wait to get the Master Ball so we can go and get the uh, randomised Zap. Oh, Christ. Um. Okay. Um. <laughs> it used hard on. Right, I think Water Gun should be neutral. Yeah, that's neutral. That's not, not super effective. That's not, not very effective, is it? The grind of having to beat everything is just ridiculous. And down it goes. Pidgeotto. Alright. Oh, Christ. Um, use my own bird. We've got a Pidgeotto. We could have used Pidgeotto. It was almost tempting, but then we ended up with... Um, There's worse games these days though, that's the thing, like this game came out in a hell of a state, but like look at things like um like WWE 2K20, the way that's come out, that game is an absolute a shower of shit right now. It's horrific how bad that game actually is. But obviously back then though you couldn't patch things, so. And I suppose weirdly with the Pokemon games there's quite a lot of moving parts that go into it. Like, obviously, there's, there's all the NPCs, there's all the towns, there's all the gym battles, there's all the Pokemon you've got to program, there's the Pokemon League that's got to be programmed to know when you've got your eight badges and stuff, and, yeah, there's a lot of stuff that goes into these when you, like, when you put it in perspective and whatnot. I should probably fight her, shouldn't I? Yeah, they got so, I mean, Jesus, the, um, what they managed to get onto gold and silver... <clears throat> I know it kind of gets cracked on because Kanto was supremely watered down, but when you think about the amount that's in that game, that's that's mental. Oh shite!
Oh, this might be bad. I've made a, I've made a grave mistake here. A level 23 Dragonair. Hopefully it's not got Dragon Rage. Because if it's got Dragon Rage, that's when we're at the free. Oh, that. There's that as well. I think I've got some paralysis heals though, so I think we're fine. I think we're alright. Let's have a gander, shall we? No, no paralysis heals. That's fine and dandy. I should probably have got some of them. What am I doing? We've got a bike for God's sake. Right, so. What should we get out? <clears throat> what should be our sixth Pokemon for going through here? Do you reckon we should get the Polyrath? Because we don't need to um, carry Cut anymore. For, well, for now. Right, so we can either get Polyrath, um, Porygon, Chansey, that's a Metapod by the way, or um, Pidgeotto. Yeah, you're right. I don't know, I think getting the Polyrath out might be a good idea, to be fair. It's got Hypnosis, hasn't it? So... That might really help us with catching our next encounter. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's, I think that's probably the best thing we can do. We should have enough Pokeballs if we run into anything to... Um, too OTT, too aggressive or anything like that. It should be alright. Ah, no, 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 no! Go away, Nurse Joy. And let's get Punch Toad up top. Get it leveled to... <clears throat> Jesus H. Christ, I can't stop making that noise. Yeah, your eyes aren't that good. I'm going to fight you anyway. What gym has she been to? Because how is she here if she's been to any of the gyms before here? And not one. Oh, Lord. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Um... Uh... <laughs> Sean? Sean might be a good idea. Jinx Bane of Word. Ah, it's not Dark type, is it? Yeah. Maybe we can flinch it. Can we flinch it? Ah, yes! Ah, yes! <laughs> Wonderful. Wonderful. Mr. Mime is useless anyway. Oh, she's got two of them. How random. That's bizarre. Ah, that's a. That's a. That's a. Yeah. So, Bite's gonna do a crap ton less now. Two barriers up. Min. Alright, I'm gonna use water gun instead then. Suck me, you creepy pedo Pokemon. Mr. Mine really doesn't look like a, the sort of Pokemon you'd want to meet in a dark alley. It's even creepier in bloody... I don't know if you've seen Detective Pikachu, but... but they kind of set a Mr. Mime on fire in Detective Pikachu. <laughs> hey, I can kind of see where I'm going. This is weird. It's quite good, is Detective Pikachu. And by the way, does my mic sound alright? Because I... I enjoyed Detective Pikachu, man. It's alright. But yeah, does the mic sound alright? Because it accidentally fell on the floor yesterday. Oh, the Mr. Mime, the burning bit. Oh, fuck it. Ludicolo is my favourite part of that movie. The Ludicolo is absolutely phenomenal. Like, without doubt. It's, it's phenomenal. I may have picked the wrong Pokemon for this. But I'm not sure what else we could have really done. What does Fury Attack do to it? Come on, can we get five? Can we get five hits? Nope, we can only get three, because of course we can. I am... Oh, good. Mike sounds alright. Good. 
panicked a little bit there, to be totally honest. I thought we'd, um, thought I'd kind of buggered that. What else have you got? Pincer. Ah. Well, I mean, Jinx Killer's perfect for this, but I'm going to have to use my first attack to super potion it. Oh wow, it doesn't even fill fully, I didn't realise that was a, that was gonna be an issue. Oh Christ. Come on, Jinx Killer, you've got this. And now you're dead! Scar one for Peter. Uh, we're not gonna be able to get any of the items in here, I don't think, because I'm not gonna see the damn things. Encounter! Uh. <laughs> oh, I mean, you know what? I'm gonna give Diglett a, t a, s a tad bit of credit here. It can learn cut. So, I mean, if we can catch it, we've got a legal cutter. We can release the. Um, we can release. Oh, what do you mean it woke up? What kind of bullcrap is that? Come on, don't play me like this. Thank you. Why is it when you were wild you were good at hypnosis? Now I've got you here, you're terrible. I should probably weaken it a little bit, shouldn't I? I'm scared a body slam is going to kill it. Shall I go for body slam anyway? Or double slap? Uh, we're going to go double slap because I don't want to. I don't want to run a risk of accidentally. Yeah, I know, but still, you never know. A polytoad, that's like Dan jumping on you. Come on. And we got the ground wang. Right, so we'll call it ground wang. Hello, ground wang. Round wang. Yes! <laughs> the kind of name that would not be allowed in uh, current day Pokemon games because they have somewhat strict um, censorship rules. Right, Jinx Killer, get your health back up a little bit, please. So now I just need to try and remember my way around this damn tunnel. I think the best way to do it when you've not got the, um... Ugh. Well, that's not good. That's really not good. Ah, oh, crap. Uh-oh. Uh. Come on, can we... Thank you. So we're going to have to move something that's a bit higher leveled up to the front here, aren't we? Because otherwise that repels a waste of time. Oh, hey up. Oh. Where the hell were you stood? Another science boy. Oh god, it's a Gengar. Can it hit me? Why can Nightshade hit me? Oh god, I must not have the normal type in. Oh god. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. You know what? Yeah, it's creepy, isn't it? They just sort of stood there doing nothing. Why the hell does Lick not affect me? But Nightshade did. What the hell is that? I'll tell you what the hell that is. It's bullshit. That's what that is. Unless they've all got like, li like they've got Flash or something. I don't know. It, it is weird to me, though. Yeah, I agree. It's, it's bizarre. I've always wondered about that. Especially the ones that complain about being lost. I'm lost down here. Well, no shit. I don't often come in here, but I will fight you. That's nice. That's not a way to live life. I'm in a place I don't understand. I best kick the crap out of you. With my Jigglypuff. Hi, Jigglypuff. Meet Matt Champ.
Machamp has a ten Machamp Machamp has a tendency of destroying little pink blobs. Slowpoke, ah oh Christ. Oh, I know it's defensive as hell. Hang on, I've got the fight inside. Oh god, that was dumb. That was exceptionally dumb. Jesus. Was not thinking there. So I'm pretty sure these things just come equipped with confusion. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, fun's one word, sorry. There we go, there's the confusion. And I'm confused. Of course I am. I mean, we're getting lucky with the confusion at the minute. It's not doing too much damage. If any, really. It's, I've not really hit myself, though, I remember. Oh, and I barely got any experience for Punch Toad. Right. Patoin. I'm pretty sure it was a Final Fantasy game that actually had things called Patoins and, um... If you, if you read it quick, you thought it was not a portion of it, do you know, 200 HP worth of healing, but I'm pretty sure, I mean, it might have been like Final Fantasy V or VI something, did one hit point of, of healing. So that was like one of them things that was just, oh, fantastic. Not the sort of thing that you wanted to inadvertently bang, a, bang through when you were doing a big boss fight. That sounds awful in my headphones. Screech attack. And a match champ. Young gap. Hmm. Young gap. Sod it! Let's see who wins. I got a crit. All you did was Leah, you bum pirate. My match champ is the king of the match champs. All I'm saying. Such a good Pokemon, my champ. Such a good Pokemon. Dum. Dum. Ha! De. De. Oh. I think we're getting through this cave quite quickly, though, so that's quite nice. Quite nice, isn't it? Oh, Christ. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god alive. Oh no. And it does a perfect 22 hit points of damage. Oh god. Hmm. Thank god for that. Keep on using that, my dude. Keep on... I wonder, can I hit it with Bone Club? I mean, this is probably a massive waste of an attack, but... Yeah, this is bad. I keep missing! Stop missing, you sack of turds! Oh, my God. You know, there's, a, there's an option in the randomizer that turns off um, while, like, random trainers been able to use legendaries. Kind of thought, nah, it'd be fine. I get the feeling it's missing, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm thinking that now. Usually it says it doesn't affect it though, so that's why I was like, alright, maybe we're getting, you know, maybe we're alright. Oh my god, stop using Drill Peck! Oh, right, right. Didn't want to split the pit, you know, split it the way I have there, but... Literally gonna have to. Hopefully, I can get a burn on the damn thing. Yes! That's what we needed. We needed a burn. And I think in this generation, it's, you know, burn actually halves attack. So it shouldn't be too much. Oh, thank God. Well, often leveled up. That's nice. Good. Good, 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 good. Can't remember what level um, Cubone evolves. Nah, I'm fine. I, I had that totally under control. Don't know what you don't know what you're saying. 
Everything was perfectly fine. There was no luck involved in that, it was all skill. Ish. Oh, there's a person. Oh, wait, is it? Oh, balls. It was indeed a person. <laughs> I thought it might have been an item, alright? Leave me alone. Ah, ghastly. That's fine. Well, alright. That was fine. That went down a lot quicker than I expected. Change to... Punch Sword! Oh crap, it's gonna have Peck! I've done it again! There we go! What do you mean it woke up? Oh, stop it! Paralyze it then! Bloody hell! That was a dog sneezing you actually, she's going mental! Yeah, you don't wake up from paralysis, you little dick. Right, Lily, calm down. Calm down! Lily! Calm down! When you're sneezing. Oh, we nearly one hit that. Uh-oh. Uh Yay! Punch Toad did things! And got another level up! But again, it's something to... Right, Lily! Jesus Christ, calm down! Stupid bloody dog! She's going hell for leather with these sneezes tonight. Today? Tonight? What time is it? Where am I? Are those my feet? Uh, this way? Alright, my dude, no worries. Thanks for stopping by, as always. Like I said, I might actually put these on YouTube at some point so you can actually catch the full things. <laughs> I'll see you around, my dude. Oh, fuck. I won't die, probably. Everything's going fine so far. We're not going to die. We're fine. We're fine. Boner Club! Alright, if they're Porium, we might die. This might be a problem. Come on, get paralyzed. Get paralyzed. Yeah, 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 paralyzed. I ain't gonna do too much. Obviously, it will hit for neutral, though, because of course it will. Sand attack, man. Jesus Christ. There we go. We need Polyraph to level up a little bit. We need to. We need it to catch up with the rest of the team. Right, where am I now? Oh, another battle. Okay, cool. Come with me if you want to nap die. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh lord above. Well, Peck did decent damage, that's good. We're over. We're, I am massively over a line under Trio right now, and I'm looking at. Oh my god, it got a crit. If we could kill it this time, that'd be nice. Good. Good. Porygon, right, that's fine, that's easy enough. That's gonna be a match amp job. There we go. I'm trying to remember my way around the Dark Cave is oh, around Rock Tunnel, sorry, is it's an absolute nightmare, I must admit. I had to do a victory road in Gen 3 and I forgot you needed a flash for that, so that was a, that was horrible. I'd never I'd never remember Seldom do I remember doing that bit without flash, like Doing it through normal playthroughs and stuff is one thing, because obviously you've always got something that can learn flash and then you can fly and you know, you can do all the forgetting crap, but in the ghost run I just didn't have that option. It was um it wasn't available to me because I didn't 
I didn't want to waste a, an attack on Flash, which in hindsight might have actually come in clutch in the uh, Elite Four, you know. But unfortunately, that was not the case. Oh god, this thing could kill me. Let's see if it was going to go for Thunderbolt. Thunder Wave, alright. That... You, you've got Body Slam or Quick Attack or something, don't you? Drill. Now Milo can go get poisoned on his first attack. Or absolutely bodied by the damn thing. Cool. And another level for the Nine Tails. Good. See, I think the team we've got right now is actually quite good. I'm quite happy with it. I'm thinking we're going to be able to get through this with some sense of ease. Obviously, I want a bit more coverage, uh, so... When the opportunity arises, there might be um, a slot might open up for something, like a Raichu, or, I mean, particularly for the uh, Legendary later on. Because we have randomised Legendaries to Legendaries, so the Zapdos... Well, it could be a Zapdos, it might, you know, it could be anything that's Legendary. Any items, any items, any items. I forgot I've got a repel up as well, so that's that's good. That's a trainer, we get past them, that's another one. I just want to get out of a damn cave to be totally honest now. I'm, I'm bored of being in, in the darkness. I wanna get out of the cave, I wanna get to Celadon, and I wanna get a Poké doll so we can get through the Pokemon shit. Through that damn tower without too many issues. Obviously, there's another couple of um, encounters there as well. Ah, you have one of those too, I see. First things first, heal, because don't be stupid. Don't do anything dumb. Naturally, it's going to get the hypnosis first time, and I won't pick up. Because, you know, I'm not Goldeen. I'm not equipped with the ability to just wake up after one bloody round of sleep twice in a row. Come on, Dodrio, you can do this. Up you get, Dodrio. The arm on, um... The whole arm and wrist thing on that Polyrath Sprite bugs me. It kind of... It, it annoys me a little bit. It looks weird. It just looks strange. Come on, wake up. Oh, god damn. Come on, Dodrio. Wow! Well that was that's horse manure. How many turns have we been asleep for now? Does this reset it? Does me healing reset it? I don't know. There we go, we're awake, my god. And yet we're having to go through a double slap. It's gonna hit five times now now, look here guys. Oh no, only three, only three, that's fine. And now we're gonna get paralyzed. Nope. Skadoosh. Down goes Polyrath. A Pikachu. That's that's nice and easy. That should go down in one bone club. This this early game cube was such a good catch. Such a good catch. And leave it out there to deal with the Growlithe. That'll do. That will do. Yes, you are out of Pokemon, and I think I'm out of the cave. There we are. Sorted. Hit Nightum. X attack. Meh. That's a grand, uh, a grand meh from me on that one. Right, I need to get the cutter out, which, oh shit, which is now going to be Diglett. To be able to get the, um... Oh, to get my next encounter. I think we can fish in um, in Celadon as well, so that might be quite good. Punch Toad. Whatever. Scratch is fine. Growl is less fine. Hmm. 
mental that poly polyrath's so damn slow. I suppose it gets all of its speed when it's a poly polywag. Oh, drill peck! That's that's good. That's gonna be great to have his drill peck. That's one of them moves going forward that is just gonna come in so damn good for us. And hopefully a little kick should be enough to kill this damn thing. Good. Bye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. And another grand. Alright, first we'll go heal and we're gonna get the dirt. The, um, we're gonna put um, Punch Toad away for a bit, just a little bit. Because um, we need a cutter to get through the next couple of areas, you know, get the next encounter, go to the next gym. Because of course you need cut to get to yet another gym. Alright, let's deposit Punch Toad. God, I hate it when my headphones out, it sounds weird. I'm gonna get Ground Wang out. Right, um. I put, I put it away, didn't I? See, I knew I'd do that. I knew I'd forget about it. Alright, HMO1. I hope it can learn cutting this shit. Oh crap, it can't learn cutting this generation. What? It can learn cutting fire red leaf green? That is ridiculous. I remember because I caught one somewhere. I don't remember where, but I did. Fine, we're gonna have to get cut out again. Oh, that means we're going into another gym battle with only five Pokemon. Which is great. Alright, uh, you're not the name rare. Good, repels effect wore off. That's a good thing, we needed that. What are you? Ah, good lord, we're having massive frame issue issues there. I apologise again, guys. Uh, who needs to be up top? Let's get Orphan up top, get Orphan. Orphan to the next stage of its life. You're the name writer. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to give it the name that Christian actually coined in the uh, stream last time after I named it. Because it's just a better name and it means I can put a space in there. Jinx Bin. There we go, how is that? Now we've got Jinx Bane instead of Jinx Killer. Kill's a violent word. We don't want violent words on these streams, do we? We want nice, pleasant, family-friendly words. Crap. Like that. Oh, I think I missed a couple of trainers that I can battle as well, but you know what? It's fine. I'm happy enough with the, uh, what we've got going right now. Should be able to take that. Yeah, we can tank that. And the elf almost tanked that, as a matter of fact. I mean, it did tank that. What am I saying almost? It survived it. It was still there in front of me. And a kingly, I mean, we ain't messing around with you. Um, um, <laughs> cookie, cookie. Blastoise was my first starter as well, so I've got quite um, quite an affinity to good to old Blastoise there. I wonder if the randomizer fixed other glitches in this, like um, like if you go into the Pokemon League and fight the Dragonite with uh, with a poison type, it'll just continue to use agility. Because that's quite a good little a good little glitch, and if I've got a muck by that point, because I'd love a muck. I'm just saying muck would be nice. Nice. Alright, let's get our encounter first and see if it's something that can learn code. Because if it is, then we can finally get rid of the damn the weeping bell. And that means that we can have um, six Pokemon going into the next gym. Not that they're gonna be very leveled. Ooh! That is nice, that's nice. Uh, I highly doubt we're gonna catch it, but we're gonna give it a good go. 
come on. If we can get a, drag a, a bloody Dragonite on the side, man. We're off. We're laughing. Oh, this is going to be problematic. This is going to be a problem. I don't want to hit it again because I think I'll kill it. It's got 10 levels on me. Lord, Lord Almighty! I need to be careful about the year because it's gonna do something like that. That's fine. That did very little damage. Should have gone to sell it on first, shouldn't I? And got the great balls. Like that. That would have made sense. We ain't here for sense, though, are we? We're here for uh, catching Pokemon and completing this game. If I was all about making sense, I wouldn't be doing a Nuzlocke. Oh god. God alive. Why hasn't it got Growl? Growl would be fine right now. I wouldn't be scared of a Growl. I'd be quite happy with a Growl. Go on. Go on! Yes! Okay, I'm beyond happy with that. Beyond happy with that. And we're going to call it the name that we always call our dragons. We're going to call it Toothless. Oh, oh Toothless. Boom. Well, that's definitely coming out in a minute. In fact, we're going to get it out now, and we're going to get through this route with it in our party. We haven't got Mr. Pies anymore, guys. Yes. Small victories. Small victories. Ah, suicide music. Lovely jubbly. I mean, I wonder if it can learn cut. I doubt it, but wouldn't it be nice? I really doubt this can learn cut, but again, it'd be just... just lovely if it could. Nope, it's fine. <laughs> kind of expected that. Get it up from, start leveling that damn thing up as well. Because it's one of them Pokemon that really, really slowly levels up. So it's in no way an ideal Pokemon to have, really, but, you know. Right then, let's get through this route. I've got about half an hour, I think, left of this stream that we can get through, so... We'll go for about another half hour. Good start for the um, dragon there. A Blastoise I'm going to struggle to beat, because look at the damn level on it. Oh, bubble attack wouldn't have done anything! I'd have to be panicked about that. Low kick. Gonna go ahead and assume that Blastoise is a hefty boy. Bite might do damage. Bite didn't do damage, it's fine. Yeah, we got this unless you get a crit or a flinch. Ah, good! Alright, uh, it's dark in here. Very dark in this room. Oh shit. Leaned a bit too far back and knocked the dog there, bless her. She was trying to sleep. Poliwhirl is, is Jinx Bane bait, I reckon. See, Poliwhirl's arms aren't messed up. What's wrong with it? What's wrong with Polyrath, goddammit? Finish it with Fury Attack, or it can go before me. What the hell? How is that Poliwhirl faster than me? Did my speed drop? I didn't notice it drop. Look, money is so easy to come by in this game. <laughs> you get so damn much of it. And up here, next battle please. Okay. I've got 
got nothing on that thing that can do any damage. So, Foxy, you deal with this. It's going to hypnotise me anyway. Oh, Barrage. Either which way. Just two hits would be nice. Just two. Alright, we're going to go for three. Ember should do this trick. Get some boiled eggs. Wow. Did you kill it in one hit? We really do need flamethrower on this thing. Magicka! Toothless, it's your time to shine! Unless it knows tackle, in which case Toothless, this may have been a mistake. Although this may have been a mistake anyway, good god, Raptor's not doing much damage. Been outpaced by a Magicka. Fantastic. And I'm only getting wrapped two times in a row. And then I missed. Ugh. Come on. Oh, it has got tackle. Ooh. Right, you know what to hell with this. I'm getting annoyed now. Sean, finish it. Bite that damn thing. Oh, good lord. They're only worth a damn when they evolve, but good god they can slow you down, and a Blastoise. Okay. Once again, we're going to go to Randy with this one. Oh, it's Dabadea's birthday today. I'm going to see a United game later tonight I'm quite looking forward to. We might actually score at least a goal in that game. That'd be pleasant, wouldn't it? me and my little girl tonight, my other half's out at work. Oh god, a crit. Boom. Yeah, my strongman defeated that strongman. Yeah. Ooh. Manly pose. Okay. Now the dogs are in a slight bark. It's fine, it's fine. We're all inclusive here. We love dogs. I hate these four trainers, they're so weirdly positioned, like who the hell stands like that? Who are the weirdos that stand there like that? I mean apart from weirdos obviously. We covered that in calling them weird. Jinx Brain! Because the level 26 Seedra is actually quite a worry. A massive worry when it does that. Joe Peck needs to hit well here. Another drill pack will do the trick. Two plus level up, yay! Oh, Alright, is that all you had? Yeah, you stick in school, boy. Stick to school. It's all you're good for, you son of a bitch. Oh, we can get fly in a minute. Right, let's have a gun. Lots of all the Blastoises, goddammit! There's so many of them! I mean, that said, I caught one at level 5, didn't I, by just using an old rod, so... Evidently, in this randomizer, they're easy as hell to come across! Can we get lucky and can we get a high roll? And take this down in just two low kicks? Ha! <laughs> no. Obviously. Ha! <laughs> well. Bye, Blastoise! Nice, another level for Toothless. And another level for Randy! No new moves, though. No, it's fine, Randy. It's, it's fine. We don't need new moves on you anyway. I do want Orphan to get a level up eventually, so... Because I think he's getting close to a, do his evolving level. I think, I hope. Marowak again. Oh, what a good Pokemon Marowak is. Particularly in this generation. It's always good to have ground types in this gen. Uh, normal potion will do the job. Once again, just get you into the green health area. 
Tell you what, that dude is a pimp. I'm just noticing that. It's just that dude with three chicks. He is pimping those schoolgirls. Little bastard. He's a dirty, dirty boy. Let's see how much rat does to the crabby. Brilliant. Right, we're switching you out because you're just not... Not going to do enough damage there, I don't think. And Bubble did an entire two. He did drop my speed though, so that was... Um, that's beyond annoying that he didn't do much damage. And now it's faster than me because of two speed drops. Well, at least it went down. Grimer, we know what we can do with Grimer. Smack it with a bone! Swing our stiff sword at it. Giggity. Don't disable that. Our bite's fine. <laughs> so two, dis two, two kicking out of disabled quite quickly there. And gold duck. Ah, alright. Imagine if Goldbuck had been given the psychic type in as well, it might actually be worth a shit by then. Nope! Just water. Pure water. It's alright, I'll use normal peck. That'll do the job. What are you meowing at me for, you creep? You weird old freak. Yeah, you do look silly stood there like that. You look bizarre and I don't like it. Stop doing it. Bunch of weird-ass school children, what the hell? And that's a job for Randy! It's gonna sing, isn't it? Uh-oh! Okay, okay, mist is fine. But you're damn right I panicked. And down that one goes... Bulbasaur. We can kill Bulbasaur quite nicely. We we'll use Foxy for that. That's what this fox says. There's a dead meme. Jesus. And down you go. Coughing again. We know what we can do with that. Smack it with our extendable bone. I like coughing as well. Coughing's quite cool. Once it evolves, I mean, it's crying, the anime is perfect. It just sounds so, so derpy. That's kind of why I love it, just because it sounds like a derp. And a Lapras, okay. Okay, it just got interesting there, didn't it? Right, if my Pokemon knowledge is anything, thank Christ for that. Well, you were the easiest of the bunch, to be fair, so we are. Right, shall I skip this guy and just go straight into the town? Yeah, we'll skip him and get into the town. And him. We can go back for them. We can always go back for them if we need them. You got anything worth a damn? Right, so you just tell me a load of crap, that's fine. <laughs> It's a long underground tunnel, isn't it, when you just walk in it? Anything? It did! A sleepy Pokemon did appear near Celadon. It is a Snorlax. But we're gonna rough it up! Um, Let's play this map. Let's go get Great Balls first. Because there's a couple of um, a couple of things we can get here. Obviously, we can get the EV, which will be randomised, and we can get another encounter, which would be nice. The coloration of the salad is just... We'll get the EV first. I'll tell you what, we'll do that first. We'll go and get EV. Right up we go. And that old lady is actually worth visiting in the remakes because she gives you the tea that will um, <coughs> make life easier for you 
Oh, we got one of them. Damn it. Right. Uh, I'm just going to call it back up in case, um, in case Orphan goes down. Oh, wait, no, we can call it Mother. Yeah, we'll call it Mother. That makes sense, doesn't it? Um, T. Fuck or what fit. Right, so now just, that was quite a letdown, I'm gonna be honest. The Marowak. It's a shame that you can't re encounter statics, isn't it? <laughs> I'd like to get anything other there, to be totally frank. On to the Celadon department store, just to stock up a little bit. Get the, um,. We'll go up to the top floor as well and we'll get the uh, thingies. Oops. Hmm. They're all randomised, so I don't know if it's worth getting them. Right, 20 of them would be fine. Ten of them. Ooh, apparently heavy snow is coming to the UK. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? I mean, I doubt it, but... Alright, we need to go up under the floor yet. What do you guys sell? There's something else I need from here, actually. And it's not that crap. Took a while. We need two fresh waters. Well, bugger. We're gonna need X attack, and what else don't we need? X accuracy. Let's go get some HMs, sorry, some TMs. Oh, of course I don't. Of course I don't. Why did I think I did? That was just stupid. Can I talk to you here? What can I sell you? Give me a fresh water again, or are you just gonna give me? Right, what have we got? Mega kick. Oh damn! Is it actually mega kick? It is mega kick. All right. We'll teach that to Toothless, just cause. Oh, great. I just wasted a goddamn fresh water. Slam. Okay, we'll keep we'll, we'll put slam on something as well. Put it on Randy, why not? Fill out his um thingy there. And soft boiled. All right, so soft boiled is something that I'm probably going to go sell in a minute. Oh wow, Jinx Bane can learn it. Not that I'm going to teach it, because I'm going to sell it. Alright, so we'll sell that. And I need to get another drink. And I think I've buggered myself into a corner here. Because there's one more thing that I need while I'm here. And it's all about remembering what floor it's on. <laughs> Cool, there we are. I know it's strange getting the Poké Doll, I know, but... Anyone who knows about the glitches in this game knows why I've done that, so... You know, don't, don't jump down my throat immediately. Trust me, I do know what I'm doing. 
Ish. Actually, there's a couple of Pokemon you can get here, isn't there? Right. What don't we need anymore? I don't really need a town map. To be honest. Don't need that. Don't need that. Cool, there we are. Could have put the Pokedell away as well, really. Oh well. Right, so, where's that restaurant? Yes, Blue, hello. It's a bird there chuntering away to us. Right, it's this dude in the corner, isn't it? Right, that's that then. So, next. I don't actually remember how much I need for this. So we need to find that out as well. It's this first window, isn't it? That's a Blastoise. I've got one of them, I don't need that. Oh, Christ. Well, I mean, I don't need to worry about the uh, coin case now, at least. So I can put that away as well. Wrong thing. Uh, the coin case away. And away we go. Nice and quick. I'll take it. Species claws. We've got two of you now. We don't need another one, goddammit. What else can we find in here? Unless we're going to be stuck going around in circles again trying to find something that's not on Marowak like we did with the Blastoise just now. I have accidentally caught more than one type of a Pokemon in the past just because I'm an idiot. Oh, Christ alive. Here we go. Anything other than a Marowak, please. Oh, great. Great. I mean, don't get me wrong, really good to have, but... I mean, it's just going to teleport. Well, never mind. We lost our encounter because of a damn teleport. That's annoying. Right, we'll go through the saffron. Bicicleta. Can't get into Mr. Psychic's house yet, can you? So I can't get the Psychic TM. Because that'd just be easy. Right, we may as well go and beat the rival. Or at least try and beat the rival. Um, get our encounter in the Pokemon Tower. And then I think we'll call it a day there. I think we'll call that our stream. I think we've had a successful uh, run there. This just cuts out the middleman so nicely. Well, your Pokemon's dead according to the, you know, creepy pasta. So right, though, you appear to have replaced it. I'll uh, I'll leave you be. Good God. Uh, Sean. Sean's gonna be better equipped to deal with this thing. What a gun! It. Oh, it's quicker than me as well. So of course, it. I mean, them things don't really start learning moves until gone level forty something. So I'm comfortable with that. I'm concerned about getting burned. I've got a couple of burn heals, so that's alright as well. Do you have nothing else? Oh, I was burned as well. God damn it. And then we got the crit, because of course we did. Do I, uh, let's get rid of Leah. 
Keep agility on it for a little bit. Might be worth having. Gloom. So now I'm going to get poisoned as well as burned. Or oh, paralysed. Whichever's worse, you know. Oh, I'm going to get put to sleep. For God's sake, you put my dog to sleep, you horrible plant. Oh my God. Come on, just wake up. Wake up, wake up. It's going to get to a point where I can't even two-shot this damn thing, isn't it? If this goes into green now. Come on, just finish it off. There we are. The Kangas can, alright, we can deal with that as well. Hell of a Pokemon to have though, Jesus. And despite all its rage, it's still just a rat in a cage. Obviously, of course it didn't kill it in one hit. There we go, now it's gone. For God's sakes. Star you. Mm. Jinx Bane can deal with the Star you. In fact, bloody hell, I think Vee could have dealt with Star you. A Dragonair. Didn't realise it was that lower level. And then Sea King. This is where we're going to have a problem. I have nothing that can really deal with Sea King straight away. Well, that'll do. That will do. Nice and easy, just like that. We got through another uh, rival battle without too much of a worry. Yeah, I've got a Cubone. I just didn't use it. Bye, Gary. Right, so quickly do this because I will forget. Fantastic. Right, guys, thank you very much as always for joining me. If you're new, remember to click follow, remember to click the notification so you can be with me every single time we do this. I will be doing this again sometime soon. Don't know when. Haven't really organised the schedule yet, but we'll get on that soon. Um, follow me on Twitter, same name as I am on here. Um, and yeah, thanks. again, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you on the next stream.